This week, we're traveling to a fishing cabin for a three-day fishing trip. These past couple of years, I've been lucky enough to do fishing up in Virginia, but I've done a little fishing in my home state. So after doing some research, one place in particular caught my attention, Watauga Lake. Watauga Lake, stretching out more than 6,000 acres, calls Tennessee home, along with a thousand other lakes. In 1790, North Carolina succeeded the area of Tennessee to the U.S. And the area was organized as a territory south of the Ohio River. In 1796, Tennessee was admitted as the 16th state to the Union. Today, Tennessee is home to 13 national parks, over 60,000 miles of rivers and streams, and over 1,000 lakes. We're about to load up the truck, and we have about a one hour drive to Watauga Lake. All right, so we just made it to Watauga Lake. We'll go cast out there. Hopefully you can catch some bass. See if the fish are biting. Being that we struck out the first day, I felt terrible thinking that I wouldn't be able to catch a fish and that the whole trip was a waste, but I eventually got back up and went fishing the next day. After fishing all day, not catching a single fish, I feel like I couldn't do this. Then I went fishing again the following day, and I struck out again, thinking, why did I not catch a fish? Then I realized that God was trying to tell me something. It's that even if you strike out and don't catch any fish, that isn't what fishing is about. And it doesn't matter how big or small the fish is, or how many fish you caught, or how many you didn't catch. It's about being in God's creation, and taking in your surroundings and enjoying your time with the people that you're with. Remember, when you think that you can't do something, whether it's catching a fish or passing a test or maybe even getting better at a sport, trust in God that he can help you with any situation. So remember, when you're at your all time low, trust in God. No problem is too big for him to handle. Lay it all out to him and ask him to help you because I'm living proof. Thank you all so much for watching. Remember, Jesus loves you. Subscribe if you haven't already. Videos are every other weekend. Live out the fullest and crunch out here.